Hey guys, welcome to Retro Crisis. In today's video, I'm going to show you how you can apply patches to Nintendo Switch games on Yuzu. I'm going to assume you have a basic knowledge of how Yuzu works. If you don't, please check out my Yuzu video tutorial guide, which I'll link in the description below. I just want to make it clear from the beginning, I'm not going to show you where you can download Switch ROM files and patches from. You'll have to find those yourself. And if you are going to use ROM files of commercially available games in Yuzu, please make sure that you've purchased the game legitimately. Now, after you've opened Yuzu, you need to make sure you've added your games to your library. So all you need to do is double click on this plus icon here, and then you just need to navigate to the folder where your ROM file is stored. Now that the games have been added, I'm going to show you how to apply the patches. So what you need to do is right click on your game, go to open mod data location, and then a new folder will open. And then what you need to do is copy and paste your patch files into here. So the patches I've got here are 30 frames per second, 60 frames per second, and visual fixes patches. So within each folder, you'll see something that looks like this, exefs, and then some kind of patch file. Now we can close this folder. And now if you right click on the game and go to properties, you'll see that the patch files will appear here. And then all you need to do is, depending on whichever patch you want to run, you just tick it or untick it, and then go to OK. Now as this is a visual patch for Tears of the Kingdom, some additional options you may want to tweak are go to Emulation, Configure, and then go to Graphics. Make sure you have Vulkan selected. I prefer to have VSync on. And then you could bump up the resolution if you wanted to, but I'm just going to leave it on 720p. And what I do recommend you do if you go to Advance, just make sure all these are ticked and then press OK. And then if you want to run the game with the patches, just right click on it and start game. And that is pretty much it. Mm -hmm. 